Good morning guys and welcome to June 4th day 21. Today is officially the first day of summer, woohoo! It feels like it's been summer for a while, I don't know why, I just, maybe it's me being optimistic or overexcited about summer and like, yes it's summer! No, it's actually summer now. Um, it's about 8.30, almost 8.30 in the morning and I'm talking quietly because the boys are asleep still. It's Sunday and I am getting ready to film a couple of videos. I have all of my stuff set up in here. So you can see how lot of the products and stuff, sneak peek. I'm actually filming uh, a makeup look and then my monthly favourites because I'm, I'm going away again tomorrow morning um, and I don't want to take all my camera equipment with me because I've only got a small suitcase, blah blah blah. Um, so I'm filming both of this week's videos today. And then my dad's coming round for special Father's Day brunch um, at like 10. So I have like an hour and a half to get this done and yes that is what's happening this morning i did not want to wake up this morning my alarm went off at half past six i was like no snooze and then it went off again no snooze no snooze and then mike woke up he's like how many alarms have you set i was like oh sorry i can't stop snoozing okay so my filming mission is complete and uh, I'm gonna have to tidy up later because my mum and dad are about to get here and I have stuff all over the floor. Um, all good. Anyway, let's get cooking. So I finished filming, walk into the kitchen and what do I find? Jack is in here, washing his hands at the moment, but he's already started chefing it up. This is bad. I can't, you can't cook my dad Father's Day I'm breakfast. He's cooking your mum. He's doing prep. You're cooking for my mum, are yeah, you? you're okay. cooking your dad. <laughs> Well, and Mike is like nowhere to be seen. I think he's upstairs having a shower, which is pretty atrocious. Did you make? Did you lay the table? Or did Mike do that? No, Mike laid. The table. Okay, Mike laid the table. Look how pretty it looks. Ta da! Now I'm actually going to help Jack cooking. I'm not going to let him do it on his own because that would be really bad. We are doing eggs Benedict. Let's do it. I did not realise. Apparently, Jack's already cooked some of the eggs. They are sitting here in ice water. Which will you explain this, Jack? I find that really odd. Why are they in ice water? Well, well so you're cooking poached eggs for loads of people, right? And it's yeah. really difficult to get loads done at the same time. So if you cook them to like half two, cooked, half cook, drop them into ice water, then you can chuck all of them in boiling water at the last minute, finish off the cooking and serve them all at the same time. You learn something new every day. This is why every time Jack comes over, he ends up cooking because he's basically a much better cook than me and Mike. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna try and help. Can I do something? Um, you could do the Hollandaise? Yeah, you could do the Hollandaise. Look at his face. Sure! Mm -hmm. <laughs> you can do the hardest bit, not. I've just noticed Piglet observing Jack cooking the Hollandaise. Look how she's sitting. Pooj, you are silly. Look at those silly legs. You are a silly girl. This is getting, it's getting real and serious right here. Uh oh. Right. Check out the result. Pretty impressed with that. High five, Jay Art. That was a shit one, let's do it again. Wet go on no. <laughs> yes. So I may or may not have had a very, very quick little nap on the sofa for 10 minutes and I feel much better. Power nap, seriously, it was a great power nap. Um, we're now on our way to Jack's house, where we are about to leave. Jack's just getting his stuff, because Jack's parents have a pizza oven and instead of doing a boring old Sunday roast, which I hate, Personally, as you guys know, I've spoken about it a lot before. I don't like Sunday roast. We're doing pizzas. Exciting. We just got back. Well, we didn't just get back. We've just left lunch at Jack's. And I didn't vlog because it was basically full of Jack's parents' friends and not really a vloggable situation. But we had amazing homemade pizza because his parents have this big pizza oven. I really want one of those. Yeah, I'm quite apparently really expensive you can get, to build, though. You, apparently, you can make one like well, in. Bumpy road. Sorry. Indoor, apparently, like in to do with like off the kitchen into the conservatory. Really, so you you'd want one, you wouldn't want one indoors. No, but apparently, so you could. So in the win in like the summer, you open up the conservatory doors and it's like air. And, and in then the in the winter, winter, you just gas yourself. No, because the, the apparently the chimp like you put in a flume and it gets rid of all. It's like no smoke oh. whatsoever. That's what our friends were telling us. I'd quite night. like to have one outside. I think. I don't know where you'd put one though. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. Somewhere in the garden. Competition. Um, but yeah, so now we are off home. Packing time again because I leave at seven o'clock in the morning to go to Cannes tomorrow, which is exciting. I wish you were coming though because I'm gonna miss you. I'm gonna miss you oh. so much. Not really very much. A little bit earlier, I know a little pig that went for a little walkie. She did, and she ran away, and she came back. Piglet, pig, come here. She came back very muddy. 
So you know what happens to muddy dogs, pig? Has anyone told you about this? Has anyone told you what happens to muddy dogs? <gasps> they have to go in the bath. Oh no, in the bath. Bath time, little piggy wiggy. Bath time. And for any of you thinking she doesn't look too dirty, just you look under here, you little you rascal. Like, ha -ha. This is what we do when we're waiting for the bath to run. I'm not entirely sure what's going on here, Squidge. Squidge is like desperate to just be in the room because she knows Piglet is getting attention that she is not, even though she doesn't like baths. And Piglet's like, oh no. I've seen loads of those videos on YouTube where you hold there's people like holding sausage dogs above water and they act like they're swimming. And I want to see if Piglet does that before we put her in, if she like tries to swim. I reckon the problem is because she's never swum before, I think you need to let her in there, get her swimming. And get her swimming around, it, and, and then, then do it. Because I think then she'll be like trying to do it. Because, probably because she doesn't know what she's doing. The other, yeah, because the other dogs have swum a lot yeah. before, Piglet's yeah. never swum. So she's had, she's had bars before, but she hasn't had like a deep bar. So this is why we're testing it out in the big bar. Right. Because normally she goes just in the sink. Here we go. It's Piglet's first swimming lesson. She's like, I'll just give you I'll a kiss. I'll just give you a kiss. Please don't put me in. Oh, no. See if she does the leg thing first. I don't think she will. No. No. She's like, oh. <laughs> oh, oh. She's like, oh shit. Oh, oh shit. Piggy. She's like, what the? Can oh, she I'm swim? Like, she's starting. She's doing it. I've got her. She can swim. <laughs> oh, Piggy. Good girl. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, no. Okay, we've taken a bit of water out so she can stand up. I think this is shallow enough. Look how dirty it is already, Poog, and you were in there for like a second. Oh, you okay? You okay? See, we wash the pig. Oh, wash the pig. Good girl, piggy. See, you're lucky. Some doggies have freezing cold water. You've got nice warm bath water. Get some shampoo on. So it's safe to say this is the face of an unimpressed piglet. But I just wanted you guys to check out the colour of the water from one very small dog. And it's got a lot of dirt in the bottom. Piglet, you are a dirty little beast. Are you ready to come out now? You're pretty chill now, actually. You're a good girl, Pooge. Look at her floofy, floofy bottoms. <laughs> the water is really funny. And this is how we dry the pig. She's thoroughly unimpressed right now. She gets a good old rub until she goes super duper fluffy. <laughs> She's like, stop filming me. This right here is a very unimpressed sausage dog. <laughs> oh, piggy, you're so squeaky clean. Are you gonna wipe yourself on the carpet now? Oh, I thought so. She really wants to go downstairs. Are you a monkey? <laughs> Big. Look at those eyes. Come on then. So I've now just cleaned the bath and I'm ready to actually have my own bath. Um, I'm kind of like mid packing and I'm a bit bored to be honest. So I am gonna be trying out these this evening, which are um, like smelly rose petal things. I don't know, I got given them as a gift. And I'm watching the new series of Orange is the New Black, which I tried to watch a bit when I was in Vegas, and I kept falling asleep. So, we'll see how it goes. Have you guys been watching it? What do you think? Is it as good as the other two series? I'm on episode two now, so we shall see. I don't know whether to put these in whole or break them up, so I'm gonna experiment and put one in whole. I feel like that just looks a bit rubbish. Does it go slimy? Oh yeah, it turns into like mush. Ooh, that's weird. Turns into like actual mush. Gross. So if you break them up, they actually do look like rose petals and they smell amazing. They're starting to break up. I think you're gonna break them up. Looks cool, huh? And they're not real. So the Sunday night top knot is happening right now. Just got out of the bath. I'm finishing off my packing and then I'm gonna go to bed. What's the time, Mike? Is it? Is it already? Oh, on your fancy eye watch. What a stupid, what a waste of money. Um, this is ridiculous. I think you'll find it's not ridiculous at all. It's ridiculous, I'm trying to focus on it, there it is. Look at it, half past 10. Is that the right time? <laughs> I read it through the screen, I was like, really, half past 10? Um, yeah, I'm gonna pack now and then I'm gonna say goodnight because I will see you really early in the morning. I've got a car coming at seven o'clock. Piglet is looking slightly more dry now. Oh, Piggy, you're gonna say goodbye to everybody. You're gonna stay annoyed. Stay annoyed. Bye. Good morning and welcome 
to Saturday. Today we are chilling the hell out. Mike is here doing a bit of washing up. We've just had the laziest morning watching Saturday Kitchen in bed.